What's going on? Tech Town again. You're playing some more Mono Green Tron and Tower. No other lands. If I were going to keep a one lander, this would be it. But I'm not going to keep a one lander. Mulligan. And this is why we don't keep a one lander. This is a much better chance of getting Tron. It's not guaranteed, but I'm not going to go much lower. We keep this. What do we pitch? Some of the threats. I'm feeling like the all is dust. We've got the Karn, we've got the Worm Coil in case they have counter spells. It is the one thing, uh... With the Ban of Lurus, we no longer have as much early game clues of what our opponents are up to, but a Misty Rainforest gives us some idea, so green-blue. Slight chance we're going to be hit with a prismatic ending here, but there's not much we can do about it, but hope we draw another chromatic. Hey, still been scrying or tower would be nice off the top. Yep, there's the hollowed fountain. This looks like it's going to be a held up counter spell right here. Tower off the top. Oh, concrete creator, not bad. Tower scrying off the top. Hey, we got the scrying off the top. They're gonna let us get the tower. Nice. Okay, that puts us in a decent spot here. Watery grave. Yeah, that's more held up now. Esper colors. Feel like we go for the worm coil engine here. They likely have a bunch of hand removal they weren't going to use otherwise. That's interesting. Or they have stuff like force of negation. But either way, I'm happy to land it. Okay, so they're just going to take this up. Ah, they, the old one, Path to Exile. Okay, it's been a while since I've seen a path resolved. They've been pretty well replaced, but a few decks still run them. Oh, that's a nice find. Uh, we'll be sacrificing the Karn here. I feel like Kozilek is what we want. Uh, they debated it.
Well, if we're going to give us the opportunity to get both Titans, we will definitely take that. This feels very control, but with the way they're digging, it makes me think it might have some combo-esque element to it. There's a scoop. All right. Weird game. Um, hmm. Walking blister are a little too weak to what they have going for them. I feel like we want the warping whales. Force of vigor and wilt. Those are always the big question. I feel like since we have the uncounterable Boseju, we don't really need them. Oh, but we Emrakul, yes. I forgot what I was up against. If this is a control deck, we definitely want the Emrakul. If it ends up being more combo-y, yeah, we'll pull that back out. We didn't really see too much. We saw a lot of their draws and counter spells, which most anything would run. The big question is, what's the win con gonna be? Hey, Bochi. Hey, kitty. Taking a minute to sideboard. So they're either debating what put comes out or they have some maybe board cards they might bring in. Rest in peace, not usually brought in, but I've seen it once or twice. More likely Stony Silence. I don't know, the path kind of makes me feel or think this is an older build. Just because, or it could be, yeah, path is out of favor right now. Prismatic ending is more popular or there are more specialized cases like artifacts, decks running. They've got their own special variant of a one mana thing. That's going to be a mulligan right there. Gotta watch time. There's another mulligan. Four and a one lander. Well, I'm not getting more than one lander. My internet is apparently being slow, so I do need to watch that. If we can find a Tronland in the top two and another search card, Tronland search card would be the best.
growing off the top. Yep, my internet is definitely a little on the sluggish side right now. How long do we keep the relic around? And we still have lands to play. We have things we can do. The fact that they're keeping the opt in the graveyard makes me think that they have some graveyard interactions they care about. But we knew we were going into a long game anyway. Yep. Feels wrong, but we do play that. Definitely looking more blue-white here. Oh, okay, that's painful. Ooh, but that's pretty good for us. Okay. This ability activates. We create this. Get rid of the graveyards.
let's just bait that counter spell. They have a force here that's going to be rough. Oof, all right. Well, that's unfortunate. With how slow I'm going, I may want to restart and start game two. Like this internet thing is a bit of an issue. Nope, that's rough. The fact that they had two counter spells uh, and I don't have Tron here makes it very unlikely I'm going to get there. They took the token. That's an interesting choice. Uh, all right. Well, we have to try. Yeah, I think we'll concede here. Their advantage is just getting too high, and we're not getting there fast enough. If my internet was faster, maybe I'd keep playing that, but uh, unfortunately, oh, it was two turns away. Oh, hmm. Yeah, that Urza Saga was going to be an issue. I know what they're running. I don't think I make any real changes here, though. I just need a better hand. They are definitely more on the control side. Which does mean longer games, and yeah. I, we're nowhere close to being in trouble with it, but I gotta watch it with how long it's pausing between even tapping for mana. In fact, all right, we're back. I tried to mess around with it, uh, fix it up a bit. So hopefully that does something. Yeah, that's a mulligan, though. Come on. Ooh, there's our keep. There's our keep. We'll pitch the warping whale here. Yeah, prismatic ending would suck, but yeah, the... Just a matter of whether they have it or not. Having the backup scrying is nice. They are running force of negation. That's always an early possibility too. Can we just draw the mine? Nope. More coil engine. I'm happy with that. What do we want? Probably Sanctum here. where we start eating into their counter spells.
this will be just a regular counter spell. Yep. We have kind of indicated we have other things in hand, so they're not going to go shields down at all here. Okay, maybe they will. Yeah, this definitely feels like an old build if they're running that. Tower off the top. Well, we definitely play the tower. That's what we wanted to see. All right, sacrifice the sanctum. Ooh, a counter bounce would be pretty rough here. Okay, snapcaster counter spell. Yep. We still get the Kozilek. We're a little far away from the uh, Imrakul so far. Another Field of Ruin here would be painful. Knocking on wood, that doesn't happen. If they have the path in hand, they could theoretically play a little aggressively and go for like a Jace here. Nope. Okay, they're just going to hold up a counter spell. Oh, and we get the big Emrakul and the tower. We are two turns away from there, and I think we are in a very strong position. We've got backups of all the Tron lands in hand. There should be still be one force in the deck. They won't target the mine first off, so yep.
We are in a very strong position indeed. All right, so that, that, from that we can likely infer they have the Teferi. Oh, little Teferi, all right. Do they take the time to counter this? Looks like they do. Oh, they're debating it. Oh, they're going to force. Okay. Well, we'll just go for an Ancient Stirrings then. There's the counter spell. And we land our expedition map, which will guarantee us that we at least have Tron next turn. They're down to one card in hand. I think we're in a very good position. If we're lucky, they'll play their land first. Their best bet would be to bounce my expedition map before they play their land. Because that'll force me to trigger it. To get the mine to protect Tron. They could not have a land, though. If we land the Embercle, we win. Uh, they need a path. And the extra turn would be pretty devastating. But, yeah, Flying Trample, 15-15. Hard to deal with. Oh, interesting option. Okay. I guess we grab the Sanctum here. Now we can't play it off the Emrakul, but we use it to get something off the Ugin next turn. If Emrakul doesn't just win us the game, here comes the big boy! Low tap all that mana. Actually, this is protection from instants, isn't it? Oh, no, just more one colors. Yeah, no, this is game. They aren't going to have an answer to this. I, I always forget the text on this guy because it's so... It's a wall of text. So can't be target... The other one's protection from instants. So this needs pretty much a board wipe to get rid of it. They could have it, but they need a... They didn't, oh, they didn't, uh, plus, yeah, so they can't even cast their board wipes on their turn. All right, this will be game. I do not see them getting out of this one.
Now we could flex and try and play some other things, but um, it's better to just attack and in case they do have something in hand. Annihilator 6, that'll be all their permanents. And that will be game. All right, cool. Thank you for watching. That was a, not the best league, but yeah, Tech let me know what you think. Tech Town to catch here, signing out.